What's up guys, Erwin Tech here, back at it again with another video, and today I'm going to be showing you the ultimate guide to unlocking all sites on your school promo. This video will include movies, TV shows, games, unblocked browsers, unblocking sites, and so much more. So this really is the ultimate guide. Before I start today's tutorial, make sure you go subscribe to my YouTube channel down below so you can hit 40,000 subscribers. We're extremely close, we just hit 39,000. Also, make sure you go follow my Twitter linked in the description below. I post YouTube updates, random stuff, and if you're interested, go check it out, linked in the description below. I'm not gonna waste any more of your guys' time, let's just get straight into the video. Hey guys, here are all the membership shoutouts for today's video. Make sure you go subscribe to their channels and let's just get back to the video. Alrighty guys, so before we start this tutorial, all of these websites will be linked in the description below as always. So the first thing I'm going to be showing you is the TV shows. It's in this folder right here. You can look at all of these websites that will allow you to watch TV shows and movies for free. There's this one. This one, you can connect your Netflix account and watch. You got this one with all these shows on here. And you got this one too as well to watch all these shows, all these movies at school. Again, all of these will be linked in the description below. Then after that, we can close out of this, go to games here. And the first one is Drift Boss full screen. So basically the point of Drift Boss is you can unlock all these new cars. I already have most of them unlocked, but you can choose your power-ups. Then you click start drift. You use the space bar to go left or right. So space bar, unspace bar, space bar, unspace bar. And you try to not fall off, get the highest score possible, collect coins to get new cars, and it's super fun. Oh no, ah! All right, so next up is This Is Sand right here. So basically this site allows you to draw with sand. It's super cool, so I'm just gonna click play now. You choose your color up here, then you just click and it will pour sand everywhere. And you can create certain images and art stuff and it's super cool and fun to play. A lot of people use this at my school. Next up is chess.com, the most popular game at my school. Everyone plays chess.com. So what you do, you click play online. You can, or you can play a computer, of course, if you're bad. But if you're a pro, you, you gotta play online, you know? You can create your account and play with hundreds thousands, hundred thousands people all over the world and you can play chess with them. It's kind of a strategic game. I'm pretty sure you guys know what chess is, but it's really fun. Links in the description below for everything. So let's get on to the next one. All right, so my personal favorite here is Tetris. If you don't know what it is, it's an old school retro game um, where you like have all these blocks that will fall down here and you gotta fit them perfectly. And if you like line them up all perfectly, you'll get some points and it will go down a bit. So your goal is to try and not reach the top so I've been playing this a lot and I'm pretty good at it so let's see how good we can do really quick you guys get the point so basically that's what you do for Tetris it's super fun my favorite game as you guys just saw and now on to the last one and the best one so this is unblocked game 66. So normally Google sites would be blocked on my Chromebook, but it's covered by this link here, then sites.google.com. So it's unblocked and it has a lot of these fun games on here like Pixel Gun Apocalypse 4 and thousands of games here. I'm pretty sure it's at least a thousand. Look at all these. So many choices. They have slope on here hockey, tennis, you name it, they have it on here. It's super fun to play. Again, all sites will be linked in the description below. And now onto the final hack. So basically, you wanna to go to browsers here, then click on roll app, and you guys may have seen this one before. Don't worry, it's not the only one I'm going to be showing you. There's one straight after this. So basically what you do, you either sign up for an account or log into one. Now once you're logged in, select apps up here. Scroll down, select brackets, then click launch online. Then click launch brackets with limited capabilities. And you will need Rollout Premium now to use this one. Since so many people have been using it, you will need Rollout Premium. It's not too much money and I think it's totally worth it. So basically once you have Rollout Premium, as you can see in my old video, I'll be putting it up on the screen right now. You hit the lightning bolt, then the browser will come up and you can select anything you want. But if you want a free one, stick around. I'm going to be showing you that right now. So I'm going to close out of this. Click on this here. I'm going to close all these out right here. Then I'm going to have to sign out of my account. So I'm going to switch over to the tripod. Alrighty, guys. So I'm now signed out of my Chromebook. And what you want to do here, the tripod can't pick it up. So I'm going to pick it up right here. What you want to do is select apps down here. 
then click on College Board. Now wait for College Board to load up and we can continue. So this thing is normally a testing app, but I found a way to hack and get around it to use it for unblocking sites. So what you want to do here is scroll down, click Forgot Username, select that, click Acknowledge and Return. Then what you want to do is scroll down to the bottom here, click on the YouTube link, and this will bring you to YouTube Unblocked in College App. You can view whatever you want, and you can even sign in with your personal Gmail account, which you couldn't before. So that is the first hack I'm going to be showing you guys. Now the second one with College Board is where you click Sign In here. Then you click Terms at the bottom. See that right there, Terms? Select it. Then click the nine dots up here. Then click G Search. Now open you in a fresh Google search browser where you can search up whatever you want. Like normally GeForce Now is blocked on my school Chromebook, but I can go to play.geforce now. I can click on this link here and look, it's unblocked because normally that's blocked for me. And you can't have multiple tabs open, which is the downside to this, but you can just use the arrow keys on your Chromebook right here to switch back and forth between tabs and you can search up multiple stuff. So just to prove to you guys, I am going to search up something that may be commonly blocked on tons of Chromebooks, like Twitter, let's say. Because Twitter is mostly blocked on all school Chromebooks, definitely. But if we click on this here, boom, we're on Twitter. It's unblocked on your school Chromebook. So yeah, guys, these are all the hacks for your school Chromebook today. I really hope you enjoy, and I'll see you all next time. Yo, thank you all for watching. Here are all the shout outs for today's video, and if you want to be featured in one of my videos, just comment down below, I subscribed, and I'll give you a shout out in my next video. Anyways, guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's video, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.